y'all, Tracy here, back with another reaction video. I am very excited about this, and it's kind of bittersweet because I didn't find out about it in time to watch it live or to actually go to it. I don't know if this was like a concert that anybody could go to if they paid. If that's the case, that kind of sucks because it was right in Austin, Texas, I believe, and that's like less than a day's drive from where I'm at, so I could have probably gone to this. I'm gonna have to keep track of where Pink Guy is going and stuff, so if y'all, I followed I follow Joji on Twitter, so hopefully I can keep up with it there, but if not, then hopefully you guys can keep me filled in, because I would love to go and see him. Like, can you imagine me seeing him? I would probably die, okay? I would probably die. So... Yeah, but this is the closest thing that we got to, to live. This is recorded from the live performance. This is called Filthy Frank Pink Guy, live in Austin, Texas. Yeah, so that's really close. I've even been to Austin, Texas. Damn, I doubt he would come to Kansas, though, because Kansas ain't got shit. No bands come to Kansas, ever. Bayside came here one time, and I went and saw them. And they probably come here more than one time, but I, I saw them once. And Ken Clarkson's been here with Reba once, but other than that, it's very, very rare that anybody comes to Kansas. But if he did, that would be awesome. I would die. So, so Joji, if you secretly watch my videos, come to Kansas and I'll make you come, okay? Here we go. Let's check this shit out. I'm excited. What's up, I will. 
any of your favorite singers or favorite celebrities and to me he's definitely a celebrity and watching any of that like live it's always that that mix of like damn I wish I could be there I'm so jealous of every single other person in that audience especially the ones touching him at the same time it's just so much fun to watch them live or watch every single rendition of every single song and every single version of their shit because you fucking love them so that was awesome. I really, really, really hope that you guys will keep me informed if I miss it because I'm not entirely sure like what tours he does and things like that, but I would love to go and see some of his shit whenever he's performing because that's something I would spend money on. I would splurge for that shit. The idea of maybe meeting him would be really cool. And I know it doesn't happen all the time. Like you don't always get to meet them. I've realized that. Like I didn't get to meet Bayside when I went to the Bayside concert. And when I saw the Kelly Clarkson concert, I missed the meet and greet. <sighs> but it's still fun to be in the audience and sing along with them and jump around. And it's just such an exhilarating thing. And I would love to do that. Like go to a Pink Eye concert or just go see Joji live if he does other things too like that. That would be really cool. So keep me informed on the, on the Pink Eye and Joji and Filthy Frank news. Because... I do check my Twitter, but I don't check. I check only every, like, five days, and I miss a lot of shit because I got a lot of shit on my Twitter. I follow, like, everybody that follows me, so <laughs> there's a lot of people. All right, thank you guys so fucking much for watching. I love you guys. You are the best subscribers in the entire universe. Thank you guys for telling me about this. I wish that I could have seen it live because I know he he did it live online, but I missed the comment. I didn't see it until a couple days after that comment, so it was, like, kind of fucking missed it which is on me that's not on you guys thank you for telling me like comment subscribe share etc etc peace out